Greetings, programs. This is Wretch, and welcome back to Spirit Fair. Now, in the last stream, we had kind of a really, really melancholy um, experience when Uncle Atul decided to leave without saying goodbye. So we are down another crew person, guys. And I have a feeling we're probably going to see more of that before the end of this stream as well, so buckle up. We are here, I believe, in Oxbury. We've got three people needing to talk to us right now. We also got a brand new companion, Elena, who is, um, seems to be a very, very sad person. But I think everyone is awake now. Let's get everyone fed and then we'll talk and see what's going on. And I don't even know what this dog likes. Dog does not like meat. Let's try veggie. Maybe. Grain salad. Thank you for the meal. Hey, happiness. Still won't let me hug, though. I'm not even going to attempt it. Kitty. Something new. Oh, it's Francis who wanted to talk to us. Okay, I am refuse to sell any of Stanley's pictures. Ah, a quick Stella! Oh, wow, nice. Nice digs. Ah, there you are! <clears throat> it is with great pride and unbridled joy that I present to you uh -huh. humanity's legacy, my finest exhibition yet. Not too bad, don't you think? An official opening? Uh -huh. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, you know how I am. The spotlight is not for me. And besides... I don't know what that word is. Are a waste of time. Uh -huh. Nothing but an opportunity for officials to run around. Licking each other's... Well, <laughs> you know what I mean. Uh -huh. Well then, I entrust all of this to your good care. I know I can trust in you after I'm gone. Uh -huh. Oh, don't act surprised. You very well know that I'm not the one to hang around longer than necessary. And I'm pretty confident I've done all I could here. Good old Gustav, always looking ahead. But it was quite exhilarating, this whole endeavor, wasn't it? Well, as soon as we pass by the Everdor, be a love and drop me off. It would be appreciated. Oh my god, we're gonna lose freaking Gustav already. But, I mean, at least it's pleasant. Yeah, he's just like, all right, I'm done. I can go now. You give me a hug. Hmm. Well, good. Let's not make this a habit. Okay. Oh. Commander, I love being your humble servant and telling other stories and crafting monsters and having a dungeon master screen. What I don't like, though, is that I'm not the only one buying all the books and usually preparing everything. But Bob, Brian, and Jerome are cool enough. I mean, yeah, they could, sure, they could, uh, for sure make an effort. Brian is chill, though. That being said, I always have to remind him of the rules of flanking. Well, me or Jerome, anyways. That guy, polar opposite, doesn't give a single frack about role-playing. He only wants to roll dice and find loopholes in the rules. Yeah, it pisses me off. But hey, at least Bob usually backs me up. Well, maybe Bob is in character a bit too much? But hey, who am I to judge? And you're off. Ta-da! That was amazing, right? I'm sure everyone liked it. Please, Stella, go and ask around. But wait, 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 wait. Don't flat out ask about it. Don't make it too obvious. Be cool, Big Hat. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and give you food, though, first. Here's some candy. All right. Where is Bruce and Mickey? Hmm. 
or somewhere around here. Uh oh. Um, food. Crap, what did you like? Comfort food and old fashioned food. Meat stew? There you go, buddy. Oh, outrageous! Oh, the humiliation! Stella, I'm just absolutely livid. You wouldn't believe what just happened. Some no-good foul-mouthed miscreant just had the audacity to call me... I can't even say it. An art collector. Completely, utterly unacceptable. Who? I won't tell you. I am a man of honor. Of principles. Certainly not a petty tattletale. Art collector. As if I were one of those base mercantile creatures. What an insult. Narrow-minded fool. I am no art collector. I am a curator. I do not amass, evaluate, weigh, or risk. I do not trade. I protect. I alone ensure the legacy of humanity's greatest achievements. What? Overreacting? Have you gone mad? I thought better of you, Stella. Uh -huh. Then again, perhaps crude sensitivities need to be cultivated, and perhaps that is also the essential role of the curator. Uh -huh. As usual, you get me thinking, Skipper. Maybe I'll cool down just a bit. Ah, some good may yet come out of this. Gustav was all over the place, wasn't he? There you are. Alright, do I have any bar food? Um... Here, try this. Oh no, you don't like... Oh, okay, that worked. I think Susan may have gotten to him. You know, it ain't no professional theater. But, hey, it ain't bad. We kinda liked it. But it seriously lacks snappy action moments. At least someone died at the end, so there's that. Okay, that's a better review than I thought we were going to get from Mickey and Bobby. Okay, is there anything else that we can talk to him about? Is Gustav right behind him? Yes, I think so. Or it's Bruce, excuse me. Hey, your field's getting destroyed. You need a sheep corral, and you need to feed them. Everyone knows that. These stupid sheep will always eat your crops. Ridiculous. Ah, oh, is that what happened? Okay. Well, that's okay. It was just some grain. Let's go ahead and get this settled while we're here. Man. I am... I'm gonna miss Gustav. Like he seemed to focus on his on his work, but I do like the fact that he was just like, alright, I've secured my legacy, I'm ready to go now. He just seemed like a person who didn't have enough time. You know what I mean? Ooh, onions. I'm terrified of planting odd or weird seeds now, because I don't know if we can stand any more companions. Though I do really like Stanley. Well, Uncle had those kind of melancholy moods, so, I mean, I'm... I was shocked, obviously, but... At the same time, not surprised, if that makes any sense. Yeah, I like that, Kath. He mentioned debilitating illness, so maybe that combination of that plus never having total creative control, he was able to have his favorite exhibition, and now he's good. That's a good way to look at it. Okay, well, let's go ahead and uh, travel. 
Oh, we're not going to hear that anymore. Uh -huh. And we're not going to get all the... All the antiquities from him. Don't tell that child, but he's not ready for the limelight. That's why I don't teach children. They whine and scream and think they're good at things, which they are not. But telling them would be devastating, so I just don't interact with them. Psh. That's fair. Alright, give me a sec. I know people need to talk, I just want to... Oh, God, all right, Stanley wants to talk. Oh, okay, the music stopped. A student. Must I do everything for you? You have not prepared lodging for me. I'll write this quickly. Uh, something sparse. No frills. And I needed post haste. Go now. Elena's cubicle. Four walls and a roof. Okay. I thought we had... Had everything... Wow. Linen fabric, steel sheet, and a pine plank. That ain't too bad. Oh. What did they say? Really? Really? They all said they liked it? Really, really liked it? Are you sure, Big Hat? I don't know. I'm just not convinced. Well, I can see it on your face. They told you they liked it, but it was not good. Oh, it was terrible and I didn't do it right. I know it, even if you try to hide it. I just can't do nothing right. I'll never make another play. I hate it. Hmm. I don't like hearing so many bad things about me. Why were people mean? I don't get it. People usually like my plays. And I like doing them. No, I don't really feel like doing them anymore. Hmm. We will keep talking to you. My mom sometimes yells at me. I don't know why she does it. I kind of feel the same now. Bad. I don't feel so great. I think I should be alone. I want to hug you! Stanley's about to go, isn't he? Anytime any of the characters want to be alone, they usually end up going to the door. Afterward. <sighs> okay. It's almost nighttime. Let's wait till the morning. I need iron and carbon. They're dropping like flies, people. Plenty of that. I don't know. It's just after we had kind of had Gwen follow us around for a while, I don't feel like when they want to go to the Everdoor, I just take them to the Everdoor. Because that's what they want to do. And it's, and it's wrong to kind of keep them here, I feel. We'll work on Elena's house while we're thinking about this.
Ooh, that was garbage. That's true. We need to give her a damn fine cup of coffee. She would have been happy with some freeze freeze dried taster's choice. Gustav likes fancy food, so we have to send him out in style. Do we have how much what do we have any fancy food on the among our collection? Exotic. Fine dining. Yeah, let's give him some lobster on his way out. How's that sound? That's a fine meal to have before you shuffle off the mortal coil. You need to get away from my plants. Okay. I think we've got the linen stuff already. Let's go ahead and... It was the... Steel sheet. We need two of these. I think I have both. Like I said before, I'm not a... I like, like, um, crab more than I like lobster. Poutine and cherry pie and a damn good coffee, that's nice. That's a great shout. everyone talks about their last meals. Hey, Vito. Alright, lobster is done. Gustav's gonna eat good before he heads off. I think we might have enough now to build Alana's house. Oh, nope. We need the fabric. More fabric. That'll do it. We'll go ahead and put her above Bucks. What did Buck ever do to deserve that? Oh, she's already passed out. What does it look like in here? Very Spartan. Hmm. Ah, oh, look at him. Sleep on his... Oh, that's what we were gonna do. We are gonna make sure that Buck's uh, house was absolutely pristine. How's my brood doing? Oh, doing good. Oh, 
Oh, okay. Rose gold sheet, gold, slate, celery, and an oak plank. Okay, so there are things to... Very simple. Various figurines. You gonna get your figurines. Homemade paper, linen thread, carbon powder. Grab some eggs. Oh god. It's morning. I think it's morning. I can't see the... Did I remove the... Oh, I did. There it goes. Well, this will do. This will do nicely. But let me warn you, I need the bare minimum. Please do not add anything to these quarters. Not a single ornament. Hee <laughs> hee. You gonna get some add-ons. Morning, Buck. Okay, you're good. Let's head to the door. Sheep one is fed. Nope, oh, here we go. Ah, uh, let's go. I gather you're ready to take me away? Yes. Uh -huh. Very well. Onwards! I like this, though. He is just, you know, he's like, alright, let's go. Let's get it done. He's the only one that seems not sad. He seems, um, is uncle still available for hugs? Can someone let Vito know <laughs> what happened? Yep. He's handling... Gustav's handling this like a boss. Okay, before we do anything... Ah, uh, no, we gotta wait for you to get hungry, Gustav. The one time that you don't need... Here. Please tell me you, you'll want this. We made this special for you. Uh -huh. No! Okay, we're just gonna wait here on the boat. Until you're hungry. <laughs> Should be any time now. Actually, this is a good time to go ahead and feed everyone. You already had a grain salad. Okay, no food. I see. I see how you are. Get yourself some onion rings. There you go. Some happiness for Stanley. He gets himself some pancakes. Okay, you're still good. Gustav, how you doing, dude? Ah! So, I bet you're wondering why I brought you all here today. 
Plain rice. Yeah, that might be the ticket for Elena as well. Just very, her life seems very Spartan, very minimalist. Gustav, you may be very curious as to why we're doing this, but you're gonna, you're gonna thank me later. Oh, I can't even go onto the. Go fling some. I can't use anything. There we go. Now you're hungry. Uh -huh. hmm. uh -huh. Oh, he's just ready to go. All right. Let's go. It seems to me you are quite surprised by my request to leave. And it seems to me you still are. But you have to understand, Stella, that everything is but a meaningless arrangement of atoms. Everything you've ever known, seen, or experienced. Fortuitous circumstances. In the universal chaos, humanity emerged. Not a tiny bit more pur purposeful than the rest but with an incredible faculty. Uh -huh. That of creating meaning, however fleeting it may, might be. Uh -huh. I have no inherent meaning. Neither do you. But we can create, organize, and put in order. Uh -huh. And thus create purpose and meaning. Transcend the primordial chaos. All of humankind does so. Uh -huh. We create machines that are useful to take control. Machines like the dreaded chair. The one that subsumed me, made of me an object. Uh -huh. But maybe also that made me truly realize what impermanence means. For our numerous creations only have meaning as long as they are useful. My chair when it finally became unneeded, uh -huh. became once again a heap of metal, melted back into the universal chaos, lost its inherent humanity. Uh -huh. Usefulness is an easy way to meaningfulness, but not a trustworthy one. It vanishes as quickly as we do, uh -huh. and so it seems the only hope humanity has for transcendence is through art. Meaningfulness pulled from our chaotic minds, not for utility, uh -huh. but for its own sake. And after the artist has been long gone, turned to dust, uh -huh. the art remains. And even after the last one of all humans will have returned to the primordial chaos, uh -huh. provided that we have protected it, art will remain. Uh -huh. And so it is that art alone is left in our wake. The only veritable form of transcendence to ever have been in our grasp. Proof of our existence and of our pitiful efforts to raise from the chaos. Uh -huh. As would some unknown script from a long gone power. Man, he's getting, getting deep in his last words. Oh, we're here. Well, well, now, Stella. Ozymandias beckons. Let's go. Hmm. That was actually a feel-good sending, I feel. Whew. 
the old violinist. Well, let's go ahead and grab his flower. I don't know necessarily about if Uncle was a coward necessarily, because he had that big food. Uh, his, that was his way of saying goodbye, was that big feast. Like, I don't know if cowardly is the word I would use. That he just didn't want to... seemed like he didn't want to inconvenience anyone by leaving. Maybe he saw the kind of stuff that Stella was going through and saying goodbye, and didn't want that to be a... Oh, an urchin. Um, uh, that's new. Didn't want to be a uh, inconvenience. You call him a coward because you're still mad at him. Oh, that's fair. Okay, well, I guess we should go ahead and head to the camping trip. Then it's about that time. So let's see. We need some more gold. We need to go to one of the turtles, actually. That's what we need to do. 42 pieces of linen thread. Well, I think we can pull that off. By the way, let's take, let's for a moment admire all the flowers around Buck's per or not Buck's, around uh, Gustav's perch. I like it. And we've also got that right there. And that's for the camping trip. Let's, uh... I actually want to see what that area is. I'm curious. Sun Spring Square. Let's go. If Elena's the last person on the boat, it'll be like Auntie Gwen. Yep. Alright, we got a long voyage ahead of us. Let's go ahead and... Wait, 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 wait. No, no, remove. We need a ton of thread. How much linen do we have? Um, no, we'll keep on going. I think that's my favorite event out of all of them, though. Uh, let's put in some more linen. I notice a lot of our building projects now require linen out of nowhere. Yeah, it's true. Onions! Yeah, I think it, uh, that would be nice if that was the case. I was actually thinking about that. It'd be nice if some of these guys actually, you know, gave out seeds. Okay, we have arrived at our destination. I have no idea what it looks like. Well.
Sun Springs. Oh, it's a city. Okay. Interesting. Got some Eeyore weather out here, friends. Oh. Stanley wants to talk to us. Stella. Uh, I've been thinking about my play. And how people didn't like it. I it's okay. As Mom says, they're entitled to their hope being the onion. I'm not angry or sad anymore because of it. I guess there are things in life you can't really control, can you? Like... Big Hat? I don't think I can be here anymore. We should go to the Everdoor. Will you come with me? I think I'm scared. I don't think I like new places that much, but you're with me. I think it'll be alright. Yeah, can someone get Suzanne some more tissues in the chat, please? Yeah, I'm going to have to turn the boat around and go right back. I'm going to take some... Uh, I can at least explore at night while everyone's asleep. The directions? I always go just go left and right. But if you want a fash fashy, or fa flashy place to visit, my brother heard about this spot filled with giant screens. Hey, he was probably lying. Maybe you could take a look. Okay. Yeah, that would get you a firm talking to. Onions, turnips, and a large bottle. Fred! Do you know my friend Mary Ann's address? Well, thanks anyway. I've been out here gritting and busting for for the dice game. Respect the dice, boys. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I was singing along to this song. Oh, okay. It's pretty good. Uh... On my way to a happier day. Let's see if we can head up here. Yoink! Whoa, 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 whoa. There's this really cute boy that walks by every morning. I just like to sit here and wait for him. I don't have anything better to do. It gives me something to do. Green night in the big city. Welcome to the park. My name is David, and I'm one of the many rangers in charge of this region of our region's parks. I just wanted you to know that these trees are sick. They have a rare disease. We need to cut them down. I've got a crew coming later. I just wanted to warn you to be safe in the park, to respect the park, to serve your community. Have a park-filled day. I'm helping. Those are just ash trees. I thought they would be, um, pines. Hmm. Oh well. We may need those. Blueberries. All right, then. Mm. 
No, I see you. Wheat seed, yes. Oh. Hi. Hello. All right, that was that was the town. Interesting. I guess it's just a little place to farm and get that location for that island or that place with the screens. No worries. I can't even check the map now. Oh, hey. Okay. Get some more feed. And then we're gonna have to make that long voyage back. Let's see what we can build in the meantime. Were we able to get all of that linen seed? Twenty-seven thread. Yuck. Homemade paper. And then an electrum sheet and a steel sheet. An electrum sheet and a steel sheet. Thank you, chickens. God, you, are, you ate a... Okay. You guys ate a lot of seed right there. Alright, guys. It's morning. God. Hey, another turtle! And sandwich walk. Flotsam Shores. Holy crap, more places to go. Okay, well, there's a bus station right here, so it's actually not going to take us a long time to. Actually, here, before we go take Stanley, Irina. You know what? Yeah, we gotta make some. We're gonna make some simple meals. Let's do. Here, cook a cabbage. Fries for Stanley? Is that Stanley's favorite food? Oh, that's what he wanted at the fancy dinner. Good call. Good call. Okay. Lactose intolerance. Okay, Elena, yours is going to be cooked here soon. Hey! Well, well. You look beaten up, my dear. Did you see one of my sisters out there? They think they're so mature. We'll show them. I'm sure they gave you quite the hard time. Well, I'm Irina. 
And you don't have to worry, I don't bite. You can do your investing in peace with me. Just go and hop on my back. You can leave minerals or logs. I know a friend when I see one. I'll take good care of you. Well then. Gold. It's a crime you can't hug the turtle. Yeah. Uh, what is that other thing? Silver? Um... Pine. Are you all done? Alright. I'll see you later then. Questionable meal? What? What did I... Okay. Let's do that. Whew. Should we... No. Stanley first. Stanley first. Where is he? Hey, buddy. Rain really ruins a day, doesn't it? Oh, he doesn't like the rain. All right, we'll get out of the rain here. Second, buddy. There you go. I found this in my room and thought you might need it. Okay, buddy, we're gonna we're gonna hold off on your food for a second, okay? Trust me, you'll it'll, it'll be worth it. Elena's food is being prepared. And I'm gonna wait and say until I say anything to Stanley. Until these French fries are done. Mushroom salad is good. Okay. Actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and leave the Everdoor. That way we can give him his meal and everything and we'll be good to go. Or he'll be good to go. Whew. Oh yeah, well you've been patient. Do 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 do. Well, that's cooking.
Good lord. There we go. It was an electri- it was an electrium and a rose gold, I believe. I don't remember. For- it's alright, doesn't matter. Not right now, at least. Okay, french fries. Hey, buddy. What? French fries! Oh, how did you know? That's my favorite food in the whole world! You're amazing, Big Hat! Oh, look at him. Wait, are you a chef? Are you sure you're not a chef? Because that's restaurant-grade food. Yum. Okay, <laughs> okay, you're busy eating the fries. We'll leave you to it. Alright, let's head back to the Everdoor. You're leaving on a high note, I swear to god. <laughs> and... Man, we don't have a whole lot of rice. Here we go. Big Hat! Can we go yet? You decide. Thanks. I'm walking with you, buddy. Man, it's weird that we just literally popped this kid out of the ground, you know? Oh, I almost forgot. I liked it when it was just you and me. Doing experiments and running around chasing dust shades. Don't forget to do that sometimes. I, I won't be there, but I'm sure it'll still be fun. Uh, are we there yet? <laughs> People can be mean. Really mean. Why do they have to be? My mom is mean sometimes. Just like your friends after my play. And it makes me sad when people are mean. And sometimes, I, I cry when I'm sad. But then I remember... I remember what my dad used to say. Stanley, people are not really mean. Sometimes their intentions just take the wrong path. I, I don't hate your friends. They're not bad people. That's what my dad would say. They just do bad things sometimes. I never wanted to let mom down or make people not like me. I, I don't want to do bad things, but sometimes I do, and I always regret it. I, I don't think that makes me bad. Do you think my mom will be disappointed in me? Disappointed that I had to go? I, I tried. I really tried. But I don't think I did it. I like it when I win, but I couldn't this time. He was sick. I think it's okay. It's okay to lose sometimes. I, I really think it is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
I'm really trying to be brave, but I'm... I'm really scared. I wish I could be a superhero and never be afraid. I I've hoped so much that this was just a nightmare. I if this is a nightmare, why can't I wake up? I was trying. Trying and trying. I, I wanted to wake up. I always talk to myself. Stanley wants to wake up. But it never worked. I, I never woke up. It all felt so real. And it made me sad. So sad I couldn't think of anything other than sadness. You take care of Jacob, okay? Jacob is a good beetle. And he was my friend. Well, this is exactly like in my play. Oh, but this time, I'm the lead actor. I'll put on a good show, I promise. I feel strange. Uh, I, I feel cold. I wish Mom was here. <laughs> and Dad. Uh, but you're here, Big Hat. I, I really like you. I hope it's like falling asleep. That was Astrid and Giovanni. She's a... Okay. Thank you, Kath, very much for that donation. I appreciate that. Um... Stella's a nurse. That's how she knows all of these people. She's like a hospice nurse or something. So it wasn't that Giovanni was just like, all right, I'm ready to go. Like he just died before Astrid did. Whoa. Okay. That, d that answers a lot of questions. So that wasn't G. Okay. Who was he talking to or who was she talking to then? I wish I could see all of these uh, flashbacks again. She was like walking in the snow carrying her hat.
She's dead. Holy crap. So what happened? Oh! Well, there went Daffodil. Okay. As foretold, here we are again, Spirit Farer. For the last time. Feeble and helpless, a faint murmur drifting in silence. Whispered words, a simple question. Why did you choose this life, Stella? Why did you spend it ushering others through their final moments? Was your vocation an affectation or affectionate duty born of compassion? Or a display of selfishness, of everlasting uncertainty? Did you do it for them? Or for yourself? To know me and grow accustomed to my presence? To conquer me? Am I less daunting to you now? Or am I still a ghastly shadow? A deafening absence? Remember, when your body failed, you knew. You'd seen it a thousand times. You knew I would come. You fought valiantly, yet suffered all the same. I was deep within your heart, as I had always been. In your final moments, you accepted my call. Embraced by the love of your sister, embraced by the love of your mother, you slowly draw your last breath. And here we are. You know this is the end. Breathe. 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 This is the end. Return to the Everdoor. I'll be there. Waiting. Goodbye, Stella. Farewell. Third encounter. Okay, so is that like Stella's last voyage? Oh my god, okay. Well, that does that answers a lot of questions. We still got stuff to do, though. Stella and Daffodil. Bring Stella and Daffodil to the Everdoor. Okay, um, Stanley. Oh, it's a mushroom. I will tell you guys the God's honest truth. I actually almost shed a tear during that. Like that that actually hit me more than even Summer did with Stanley. You know what? We told Stanley we'd go play, so we're gonna go play. Come here. Get some ectoplasm if we need it. Yeah, you think Daffodil, this would be like right in her wheelhouse.
All right. That was for you, Stanley. Oh, lordy. All right. Wakey, wakey. waiting for us here. Oh yeah, we made grilled veggies. Um, cheese sticks. Now we're talking. I know, you want us to go camping. We'll go camping here soon, I promise. Oh, the, sh the ship is so empty now. It's literally... It's Alana. It's Buck. And it's, uh... Mickey and his brother. Uh, Commander, I... Well, never mind. Oh, corn dog. Yes, delicious corn dog. Okay, let's uh kind of regroup here. Jeez, I hope I brought enough uh, linen. I'm gonna go ahead and leave those in the orchard. Or leave those in the grower, I meant. Oh. That might be enough. I gotta be careful though. Well, video games have very much become high art, in my opinion. And a lot of other people's opinions, thankfully. Cow! Needs fed. Come here, cow. Have some corn. Good cow. Okay, there was one more thing we needed for bucks. Two... Steel sheet. A steel sheet and two things of paper. How did we make paper again? It was glue and... Sawdust and glue. Okay, excellent. How much household glue do I have? I've got two. I got plenty of sawdust. Sawdust for days. And just a normal steel sheet, and Buck's room will be complete. And then we'll probably have to say goodbye to Buck. No, we still have to get his, um, his crew together. to assemble the party. So I think we probably have like one more stream of this, maybe. I don't know how much. Well, I don't know. We don't know how long it's going to take us for Elena or anything else. I guess we'll have to see. Still got plenty of that. Got the glue. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm reluctant to go to the Everdoor 2 dock, but it's one of those things like... Um, how can we not go to the Everdoor? I think maybe we can go to the Everdoor if we go by ourselves. I think that'll start the event. I think we may be okay. I hope. Otherwise, we'll... You know... These guys will be up for the next Spirit Fair. Okay, let's, uh, Hummingbird, Bottom Line Core, and Oxberry for the Silver Company. Head to Grey Mist Peaks. Acquire the Dash ability. What do you guys think we should do? Should we go on the camping trip or assemble the party? Don't do other quests until Elena's off the boat. What? I have no idea where- oh, she bugs you? Okay. Thought you knew something I didn't. Okay. Weapons! Powerful weapons. We're gonna get his house all tricked out before the D&D campaign. Oh, that's... eat the sauerkraut? Alright. Um... I don't know, let's go ahead and explore that air- that sandwich walk. I think that would be good. We'll head to the bus station and see what we got. It's a long time to make paper. Okie dokie. We'd also get the gold that we need. Bouncy boingy. I'm exhausted. <laughs> I feel exhausted. I have made paper! Fully improved buck. Now that is a fine dwelling. I would have to say. So, two rose gold sheets. Pine plank and gold. Uh, oak plank and celery. I don't know if we found celery seeds at all during this. I think she's definitely up there. With Daffodil as best wingman. Well, I actually found out Daffodil is a guy cat.
Uh, let's get some more gold. Actually, no, let's plant silver. I'm just, I'm paranoid about that. I'm not a fan of this weather. I know all you guys are like right here. What's going on? You having a meeting? Buck's getting Mickey to join the campaign. I like that. That's my new headcanon. Alright, well, she doesn't want us to improve her stuff. We're improving her stuff. I don't care. She can get mad all she wants. Okay, we need gold. Uh, two oak planks, which is easy. Gold ingot, pine planks. Let's focus on those two rose gold sheets. We're going to kill her with kindness, and if that doesn't work, we'll try a garden tool. Okay, I can't wait to see this place. Let's see what this is all about. This place used to be cool. I was buzzing and off the walls. It was buzzing. I remember a party that was... Wait. Do I remember a party? Was it just me? I remember people. Were there even people? I'm so lost. That's when you know it's a good party. Get away, sheep. Oh, my brother sent you. He told you I was lying about this place? <laughs> I've been f We've been feuding for many years. I can't bear the sound of his name. Is it capital that you return, or is it capital that you return to my brother, or it is capital that you return to my brother at once? At once, I say. You tell him about this marvel, this gem of a location. Clear my name, you great adventurer. I refuse to let his bitter rivalry rivalry go on any longer. My brother will surely reimburse you for your troubles. Garlic bread. Well, I'm a big fan of that. They tell me what to think. It's not science. It's a way of life. Oh. Okay, so this is the third one of these that we've seen. There's the other two are at the uh, lighthouses. Olive seeds. Mulberry seed. Is that another tree we can make? Wait. Gotta look and see if there's anything. Oh, mulberry makes... Okay, we already had one. My bad. Sorry, I was excited. I was just like, oh, more another tree. Oh, happy day. Okay, well, I think that was it from this location. We did get some stuff, so that's good. I like stuff. And we were over at... Was it Sunspring Square? Yeah, that's where the brother was. So let's head that way. And then we'll head over here and see what Flotsam Shores is all about. Right? Hummingbird, bottom line core. Oh, we also have to go there for the silver company. 
That's easy. That's just a little bit of uh, backtracking. And it is nighttime. Let's go ahead and get this stuff done that we need to get done. We need to find um, that one plant that we need for Elena's house. Okay, that's one thing of rose gold. Unamas. That's a quick cook time. We're figuring this, I mean, we're doing this eventually, but I'm always, I'm still kind of confuzzled as to the, what we have to do with this game. There we go. I don't think I read the instructions clearly. Okay, gold, gold, gold. Yes, her mood will plummet. She, she said as much. But she's already in a foul mood anyway. So what, what are we losing? Pine plank, pine planks and oak planks. Do we not improve her place, Vito? I don't mind it. But. Oh, okay, I was like, we don't have any oak. Yes, we do. Oh, she'll hate it. That's no, all right. She makes herself easily hateable. But I mean, she'll hate it. Yeah. Like I said, kill with kindness. I can't even look. At the, I can't look at the map. So sad. Okay, now we just need a piece of celery. Hmm. 
Okay, let's try cabbage. Okay, cabbage is just by itself. We know that that does not work. Lettuce and... <laughs> lettuce and glue. Oh, lettuce and rice. See what happens. I'm sure we've done that already, but... Sleep well, chickens. And we're back. Okay, livestock does not need fed. You're good. What about the other two little miscreants? Alright, if I was celery, where would I be hiding? Olive, sugarcane, seed, probably the big city. Potato, wheat. Celery? In the cellar? <laughs> Ugh. Okay. I guess we just haven't found it yet, or if I'm not paying attention. Which is also... Which has also been known to happen from time to time. So. Celery seed. Alright, we gotta go to Nordweiler. Morning, friends. Let's get you all fed. Okay, you're already... you're good. Am I about to get a stern talking to? I need a meal. Gave you mushroom salad. Here, I have green salad. Okay, see, she's her mood's fine now. Feels bullied by Mickey. <laughs> Buck, do you like your house, friend? I hope you do. Pancakes. All right, let's go talk to that brother, and then we'll uh, go grab the celery, finish up Elena's house, and then everyone's house is going to be, in, like, fully improved. We are getting near the end of this, aren't we? But there's a lot of places that we haven't been able to reach with the dash ability, so... Like this girl looking at me through the window. Maybe I know her or something. It's a bit odd. Oh. You actually went to the sandwich walk? You saw my brother? He told you to come back oh. here? And you came back. <laughs> prank! Oh. Classic Derek. We used to always prank villagers here together. <laughs> yeah, we got you. Hard. So very hard. Oh. In your face, random traveler. You need to stop listening to random unhelpful randos in the streets. Wow, I love the feeling of pranking someone. I should start doing this more often. Classic me. Uh, I miss my brother. Alrighty. So, um, Hummingbird. Bottom line core and Oxberry, so everything's fairly close. 
Um, here's what we'll do. We will head to the bus. Oh wait, no wait. We wanted to go explore Flotsam Shores too. I'm gonna try and drag this out a little bit more. Oh, don't tease me with a capybara spirit. Okay, as far as I was about to say. You know what's fascinating um, to, to me is everyone in the chat has reacted to different characters in different ways. Like, some of them have more emotional... Um, you know, due to uh, experiences and stuff. I find that very interesting. Whoops. Okay, that's strange. I made this whole place. It started with a dream. A city of containers in the air, floating amongst the clouds. Then I woke up and thought to myself, that's the most ridiculous thing ever, Marty. If it's just a city of containers in the sea, it makes more sense. So, I built it. Took a few years, but here we are. You did good, Marty. Okay, we got limestone. Is this gonna be like kind of like one of each type? Coal. Hmm. Oh, this place gives me the creeps. It smells like wet rags and damp towels. And fish. Mostly fish. I don't like it, but I've got nowhere to go. So I just complain a lot. Have a good one. I'm busy. I'm trying to find a gift for my brother. Something on a budget. He's not worth a full price gift. He never gets me anything anyways. I'll figure it out. I just need to think about it. Yeah, I think we're going to be able to get... Um... Every ore here, maybe. Zinc. So I'll just let you go. I mean, I can always use that bouncer. I want to see if there's anything else over here. Aha! Cuttlefish! time one more time holy crap all right more zinc Just 
want to check and make sure. All right. And we have found another door. Where's this go? Oh. Mahi mahi. Oh, hold on. Okay, it's more zinc. I guess we're good. Good day to you. I'm glad you said something. It would have been odd for you to just pass by. Well, that's it. Have a good one. And we're back. Come on, Daffodil. Let's go. <laughs> oh, the blackness. Parts unknown. And not in, like, the funny professional wrestling way. All right, let's get that celery. Ah, uh, I got drawings of me and Gustav. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. All the way up here, please. Also need to see if uh, if Susan wants to talk to us. We have because we have acquired quite a bit of crap. Susan, do you want to talk? Oh, Susan wants to talk. Glorious. All right. First to uh, Nordweiler, which I am not fond of because that's where we discovered Alice's problem. affliction. That sheep's got a vertical leap. Stella hasn't slept. I don't think I've slept since I've started this stream. Okay, pears, which we already had. Sunflower celery. We'll grab all of that just in case we need it for anything else. Sunflower is good for the chickens, but I can just grow sunflower myself. Like, that's all it creates is more sunflower seeds. That's like the only crop that can we, we can sustain the chickens with without having to worry about anything else. Oh, 
Okay. Let's go ahead and water these, and we'll head back to the teleporter. And, uh... Then we'll head to Susan's. We need some comic relief from the Snark Walrus. Sustenance, you say? Ah, uh, french fries and corn dogs. What's that other thing that we were able to cook now? Actually, we got a lot of recipes unlocked. Garlic bread. Wheat and garlic. Do we have garlic? We could grow it. You have cheese now, so anything's possible. Yeah, that's true. Let's go! shuts down, we'll just go ahead and play the music and grow the celery and get that done. Actually, might as well since we got a little bit of time. We miss you, Summer. Nope, there it goes. stuff. Now, do we have onions? Where do we get garlic at? and ye shall receive. The odd seed is um, something that we get from Francis, the vendor. It just gives us, like, random junk. Alright. Let's see what... I just want to make garlic bread for some reason. I love garlic bread. Daffodil does look very zen when he's singing.
Almost there. I wish there had been like more mini games where we got to actually play new songs. Okay. Garlic bread. The best bread. I think it is just... Yes. Garlic and... Wheat? Wheat flour. Right? Oh, hold on. Hold on. Wheat flour. Yes. Yes, indeed. That was on- what? Did I make onion bread? Oh, I probably made onion bread. That's okay. Life goes on. Let's go ahead and upset Elena. Fully improved. We're gonna get a stern talking to. Did we? Hold on. Ah, uh, you are correct. I was going to make... Where'd the garlic go? Ah, there it is. Unfortunately, we don't ruin the food if we take it out a little bit early. Just like in real life. By the way, at the end of the stream t today, guys, hang tight, because if you're a fan of the Dresden Files um, book series, I have something really cool to show you if you didn't see it at the beginning of the stream. One sheep fed. Two. Okay, cow is good. Okay, livestock is fed. Oh, garlic bread. Heck yeah. What is... What do they count garlic bread as, though? Pub food. Upgraded and improved bread. Don't talk to your friends from too close afterward. Now we got something for Mickey to eat later. Oh, and we have arrived. Let's go talk to Susan while everyone is still asleep. What do you want? Get on with it already. Blackberry. Oh, we collected all of the things. Collection is finished, yes. Claim reward. More ingots. Where are we at now? Well, you're right. It doesn't matter. It's all pointless with you. Here's something. Consider it a token of my faith in you. It's not much. Smithy upgrade. Twilight outfit. Oh, God! Mm. Look at you. You're still making dishes. Good for you. You should never give up, even when people say you're bad at it. And believe me, people are talking about your bad cooking. Bye. Salt of the earth. So, I think there is a f uh, f thing that we haven't made yet. Like one of those sheets. If we could do that, we could go ahead and get that done. 
We did brass, didn't we? Brass, bronze, crystal, electrum, clear glass, steel. We didn't do the celestial sheet, I don't think. Let's see. I guess we could have checked. <laughs> All right, it's breakfast time. Elena was not hungry. Let's go ahead and talk to Mickey. Got some garlic bread for you, friend. Okay, okay. A little bit of garlic bread. Let me get reacquainted with my favorite food. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. Aw, give me a hug there, big guy. Hey. All right, all right. Cool. I, garlic, garlic bread does make sense, though. It's either that or spaghetti. Okay, grilled veggies. Oh. This is good. This is healthy. Oh, okay. Hug! <laughs> I know that makes you sad when someone tries to hug you, but I'm going to try every so often. Buck! There you go. Hug! Alright, let's see if this is the one that we need. You know, several Draculas who would disagree with garlic bread. That's the one that we needed. Otherwise, we just use some materials for no reason. Uh, uh, oh. oh, that was the one. All right, cool. Uh, here we are again. Still going strong with the ingots. Mm -hmm. My hands are literally tied by my profession. I have to accept the trash you bring me. What is it now? Mm -hmm. Oh, your pockets are full of ingots. Remember to take them out before you go swimming. Uh, uh -huh. Here's a little something to show you. I care. Mm -hmm. Not about you, but the act of showing that I care. Twilight outfit. So help me, this girl sparkles. Oh, we have to go into Alice's house. We haven't done it in so long. Twilight. It's getting about that time though, isn't it? All right, so we've got some garlic. Six thousand gold. Oh, we can actually upgrade the ship again to go faster. That's cool. I don't know if that's necessarily needed, but so I have no idea where the dash ability is. I'm hoping we find it along the way, but we've also got... We've got the um, getting together the silver company, camping in a Cadillac with Bruce and Mickey, and finding the dash ability for Elena. And then uh, Stella's last voyage, where we have to bring Stella and Daffodil to the Everdor. So I think that this is a good place to go ahead and end the stream, guys. Um, we lost suddenly... Gustav at the beginning of the stream and then we lost Stanley and kind of found out Stella's purpose here in this world so it's been it's been heavy been pretty heavy but um, yeah 
We'll go ahead and continue it in the next stream, and it may be the very last one. I actually may go ahead and do another stream tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow night, guys. So, for Thursday. So, hang tight. Just keep in mind that I may do that, um, and we'll just kind of see what happens. Uh, if you guys haven't followed the Twitch channel, please do so. I try and stream on Mondays, Wednesdays, uh, Fridays, weekends, and random times in between. And um, if you're watching the replay of this on YouTube, I have a link to the Twitch channel in the description below, as well as a link to my Extra Life page, where I'm raising money for sick kids at uh, Children's Miracle Network Hospitals via the Amazing Extra Life charity. So check that out if you feel so inclined. Like, share, subscribe. You guys know the drill there. And we will see you next time. Later days, everyone.